Hello, this is Loredana and today I will walk you through the first version of D-Type I, a Rust crate that allows you to export your Rust crate interfaces. D-Type I supports basic types such as integers, as well as simple enums and structs. It also has support for modules. So let's run this test example which uses the libraries created with dtype i and prints their interfaces. Now we can see the interface descriptions built by the dtype i macros for the various libraries. If we build these libraries with wasmpack, we can make use of these interfaces in the browser and we can have more precise typing rules and build programmatic UIs such as this one. Now it's easy to see what functions are exported by the library and try them out in the browser or in the WASM or WebAssembly shell. And we also have access to the definitions of the various enums and structs that are contained in the function inputs and outputs. Let's try some of these functions. And we can see that the ranges were created from the type definitions. And we get the same result. Again, the range is changed based on the type definitions. And now if we try out this polish function, we actually get to see how the table struct looks like. So it has an ID, legs, a color enum, a material enum, and another finish struct with some boolean values. And we have access to these types because they were also defined using the dtype i macros. You can find the link to the dtype i Rust crates and source code in the video description and bring Rust types to your WASM modules. Stay tuned for more demos on what dtype i can unlock in the Rust and WASM ecosystem. And thank you for watching. Check out our other videos and subscribe for more updates.